612 on TMJ4 News today. Milk in the cereal this morning, cream in the coffee, cream cheese on the bagel. That dairy may very well come from a farm that is closer to home than you think. Our Julia Fellow takes us to a dairy farm in Dodge County that takes pride in their family business. There's about one cow for every three people who live in Fox Lake, Wisconsin. 500 cows live here at third generation trifecta farms. Each one knows where to go and when on their own. They are ready. They are working women. They are ready to be milked. Soybeans, corn and wheat are grown on this farm's 1200 acre field and shipped all over the world. Katie Schultz takes care of everything on this farm that has a heartbeat. Our milk right now is actually going into Philadelphia cream cheese. You can see it. All good, coming out. It is completely contained, and so it is in a sterile environment the entire time. And in order for it to get to your homes as clean and as safe as possible, it takes a lot of investment in technology by this Dodge County family. We have had three different types of parlors in here since 1992. We try and grow every stitch of feed that we can here because that's important for us to be able to control our costs. Girl power shows up in many ways on this farm, including an in ownership. Katie Schultz runs this business with her brother and her sister. Along with updated technology, so has the landscape of agriculture. 36% of all farmers are women and the female farmers are no longer called farmers wives, but CEOs just like their male counterparts. There's the term farmer's wife. Well, we only laugh because the farmer's wife term doesn't apply here at all. And you're not married. No, not married. <laughs> and when she looks back at the role her mother and father played, it was always equal. If you would have asked in the 80s who was the farmer, it would have been my dad. My mom uh, was hands on. She was out in the fields as well as managing all of the financial side of our business. How did that change? The number of women coming into ag is growing. They say it is easier for female farmers to connect with the biggest spender in the household women. And so for my sister and I, it's easy for us to relate to the working mom. It's easy for us to relate to the busy mom because that's what we are. So while you're eating breakfast this morning or when it's time to have dinner tonight, these cows will still be hard at work providing milk for our families. In Dodge County, Julia Fellow, TMJ4 News.